This is our incredible illusioneering levitating wheel. To show you how this works, I'm going to put a bit of rope on one side, I'm going to make sure the wheel is spinning as fast as possible, and now I can suspend the entire wheel from one side and it will just happily levitate. And that is the incredible levitating wheel trick. This is the illusioneering, bitterly disappointing wheel trick. It's much like the incredible levitating wheel trick, except this time the wheel's not spinning. And when I try and suspend it from one side to see if it will levitate, it just falls to the ground. It's actually the spinning of the wheel that means that the wheel will levitate. This is something called the gyroscopic effect. And what I'm doing is giving this wheel a huge amount of angular momentum which means it doesn't like changing direction. So if I let go of one side, it will keep itself upright, suspended from one end only. Until of course it falls below a certain speed, and then it will just drop off. Now this effect is actually what's used to steer satellites. Because if you've got a spinning wheel, and you make it tilt, it actually imparts quite a force. And that makes me, or the spacecraft, want to turn. In terms of everyday life, it's the spinning of the wheels on a bike that help you stay balanced. Because of the gyroscopic effect, a bike doesn't like to tilt, which too few people realise. So what you can do, next time you're bored, challenge a friend of yours to balance on a bike while the wheels are stationary. And that, ladies and gentlemen, we refer to as the falling off a bicycle trick. For more about the maths and science behind this and other magic tricks, as well as PDFs and video resources for teachers, please visit illusioneering.org.